could choose a photo from Google that represents your size. Um, I looked up size 14, I already did a video on it, and so I'm kind of annoyed that I have to do it again because the photo I copied, or uh, not copied, <laughs> saved to my phone didn't show up and I don't feel like recopying it. And she didn't really represent my body really but very well. Um, because even though I wear a size 14, my body, my thighs, and my stomach, and even my arms now, they're looking more like a 16, and you know, maybe I am a 16. Um, I just don't know for sure, because I don't have anything higher than a 14. So I have my, um, I have my 14s fit, but uh, some of them are really tight. So I probably am at a 16, which sucks, even admitting that, but I mean, I'm just going backwards in my weight loss right now. Um, I also didn't want to videotape another <laughs> um, videotape of me doing my hair again, because it looks like I did the same day or something, because I, I even have the same jacket on, but um, I am doing a coconut uh, olive oil hair mask right now. And I'm gonna work out after this video is up. And then I am going to go, uh, oh my gosh, this forgot what I said. I'm gonna go work out after this video. Okay, I did say that. <laughs> um, I'm gonna work out and then I'm gonna shower and get this crap off my hair. Um, anyways, so the photo I chose was the size 16 ladies. Um, I think I look more like the, one, the shorter blonde on your left I think it is but I can't see her belly so I don't really know um, I think my thighs look more like hers but if I go for a belly um, I think that I look more like belly wise like the girl the darker skinned girl I think I look more like her belly only because hers is sagging a little bit um, because of how she's standing honestly you know, that, that photo just shows like all the different size of um, 14s you can have. And I do apologize for the mess in the background. I did laundry and I threw it on the bed. <laughs> I haven't put it away yet, so. Okay, um, so my thoughts, because you're supposed to do your thoughts on it. And my thoughts. Sorry. <laughs> my thoughts are that. I don't like my body at a size 14 or 16. I would really prefer to be back at a size 9 where I was two years ago. That is my current go-to size and then my I will, I will start working towards my original size goal which is 7. Um, so my current size, so I look like, to me, um, to discuss what my what I, how I feel about this size is I feel disgusted. I am disgusted that I allowed myself to go backwards. I ruined all of my hard work and it took so long to get there. And it was hard. You know, being an emotional eater, it is hard sticking with an eating plan. Especially when all you really want to do is just sit down and snack on like chocolate with caramel in it. or. Lately, it's been a bag of chips, which is terrible because I had gotten over that particular craving I used to have. Um, whatever. <laughs> um, but other than the fact that I find myself disgusting, oh, and you know what? I, I can't even not mention this. I don't really want to have sex with my husband as much because I'm so big. Now, he doesn't say anything about my body except that he really, he really likes my butt, like, <laughs> he's like, I he just, he always compliments my butt now, and I know it's because, like, working out and then adding the fat on has just made it bigger, like a bigger round. <laughs> um, he likes bigger butts, but, whatever, I, I don't know what to say, like, other than that, it's all bad, like, I, I feel, I'm already depressed about other stuff, so I, I am taking it out on myself and now it's starting to go into the husband life because not really. 
Not really, I will not have sex, but I really, I'm not as into it, because I keep thinking about everything shaking and jiggling, and it just, I'm disgusted with myself. What can I say? Alright guys, hashtag team love yourself, and that is day nine completed.